Hey guys, welcome here to Snowman86. You join me here on another episode of Cattle and Crops. Um, just a quick update on where we are on this one. Once we finished that last mission, um, it kind of advanced us right through till February 20, February of the next year, so we're in 2001. The date needs to be updated, I guess. Um, you'll see our money has jumped up considerably, and that is due to the BJ constantly being filled by our worker. The good news is the pit is now empty and we are ready for another mission. So we'll see where we are. We have slurry spreading. So and I do believe at the end of this one we end up with a bigger cultivator as well. So that'd be nice. So what we're gonna do is just accept that and get going. So it says it's a demonstration model down in the dealer to be collected, so we're going to head down that way. I'm just going to minimize this as well. And we'll get going. So I'll see you down the dealer. So we have arrived here at the dealer. And it's telling us now to attach to the cultivator. So we want to just get into the position here and we will set ourselves up. that just to go down and click the cultivator so we'll see you back at the farm guys and we get this hopefully rolling then after that <coughs> so we're back at the farm we're just going to park up here to the side and we now have to enter the 940 class and get them orientated with the yard so we're just going to tab till we find it So we wait till he comes to a stop. So we'll take over there now and we'll just drive straight to the pump and we'll get him filled up. So we want full slurry and we want to fill it. So that is us done, so we're just going to jump out here now. Head back for a class. So we're back in our class and we're just going to head over here now to field 14. One thing I have noticed here is this tractor is light without the front weight now. So there goes the contractor I believe it is. So it's asking us here now to cultivate field 14. So so we're just going to hang tough here a second. Um, we're going to wait for the worker there to at least put some manure down and then we're going to get started.
So he has finished the field there guys, we have set up our steering lines and we are now working the field. So I believe he has gone to field 16 next which is just across the road. Um, so I'd imagine we'll be kind of just following him around there for the day. Because at least we can get cracking here now and we can make a good start on cultivating all our fields. You can definitely tell we are slipping here in the wet weather. Um, as I say, I did find the front of the tractor a little bit light when we were attaching and bringing the implement back to the farm. So with that said, we could struggle here a small bit. She does seem to want to vary on the lines. So we will try our best, hopefully we don't miss a whole pile on this field, hopefully we don't miss any. And you'll see the work going there in the distance as he continues to, he's continuing to um, lay down slurry so we just need to turn all this in so our neighbours don't complain about the smell and stuff like that. So with that said, I think we're going to crack on here, and i see you when we're finished here in field 14. Hold me close till I get up, time is barely on our side. that section now they are cultivated so it's now telling us head for field 16 and I'd imagine this is a case of rinse and repeat so we're just gonna head for the far side here set up our lines and we'll be away then
so to reset our lines very simply if we tap this one over here it'll pick our line straight for us and we can then adjust it by degrees here or by 90 here so that's handy and we'll see we're just not quite there so make life again easy for us we have this initial track offset option and by just tabbing over find three of a meter we're going half a meter over nearly that should see us through and we're just going to drop our working width down a fraction um, you'll have noticed in the last video we were leaving a few streaks so we're going to try and eliminate that this time so we should be good to go on that so we just creep forward here enable our cruise control and away we go So again we are just pulling slightly to the left so we're going to have to constantly be adjusting I think as we go just to try and keep us within the lines for some odd reason and again the tractor just wants to slide on the hills which again not that bad nice little touch it's not just planted it, it does like to move and it probably doesn't have to be doing this in the rain with the field has been as wet as it is as well so a lot to be said the physics are pretty good so we're just going to keep going do the best we can in the conditions we've started in and we'll complete field 16 so again i'll see you in a few minutes guys now heading to field 15 and again another case of rinse and repeat so we aren't going to time lapse this one guys we're just going to shoot through here because I'd imagine field 13 will be next on the list um, so with that said what we're going to do is we're just going to get ourselves set here again and get going so what we are going to do is we're just going to get started here and we will join up when we are closer to completion of said fields as i say i'd imagine we will be tasked with field 13 next and this video will just become very long and very repetitive so we're going to try and avoid all that um, so with that said we're going to crack on here and we'll see you when we finished up the cultivating So that completes this, we just got booted there, uh, came up mission complete, we weren't even fully completed the cultivating as you see we were on our more or less last track so we're just going to finish that track out. Um, but that is it, took an hour, is that saying one day, can't be right, 
I'm going to say more like an hour and five minutes, but that time scale seems to be a bit messed up. Um, but those will notice there now as well. We now have the bigger cultivator, the four meter one. So we might sell our smaller three meter one, and we, what money we make from that, potentially pick up a weight as well for the front tractor here. Um, so just to finish that out. As I say, we are complete. There is a new mission there for more bulls. But I think we've had enough here for one day, so we'll pick it up again on the next one. So that's it, guys. Thanks very much for watching. I've been Snowman86. This has been Catlin Crops. And we'll see you all again, guys. Take care.